What's going on, boxer fans? It's Jordan Williams with the distance. I have a video for you guys today. Um, I'm not wearing my goofy hat because I did finally decide to comb my hair. So, anyway, this is a kind of a post fight video for this 90 second bout between Sugar Jan Jackson Bonsu versus Randall Bailey. My prediction was longer than the fight. You know, um, my prediction was like about nine, eight, nine minutes. And the fight was like 90 seconds. Um, but um, honestly, you know, um, I didn't expect the fight to end that quickly. I thought um, I thought the fight was going to end in a knockout um, by one of the fighters because um, we know that Randall Bailey is good at giving out punishment but not taking it. You know, taking punishment. You know, the fight, you know, was in Belgium um, in Sugar Jackson's, um, you know, pretty much his home country. Um, with the fight being there, Randall Bailey knew he had to get the knockout more than likely. So, you know, he went out, you know, he got the knockout in 90 seconds. And in the fight, you know, um, Jackson did actually um, stay on the outside. Stay on the outside. Um, I thought I thought that Jackson, Jackson should have been a little bit closer um, to kind of take that range away and not give Randall Bailey the room to be able to throw, you know, either his right or his left. Um, I did say that Randall Bailey was was you know pretty much measured you, measured ah measured you with the left hand so he could throw the right but in this fight he knocked out um, Sugar um, Jackson with the left. Now he has power in both hands. He could put you to sleep with both hands. I think he put Figueroa to sleep with the left hand as well. So you know we all know that Randall Bailey has pretty good has good punching power in both hands has knockout power in both hands. But wow, the way that he knocked out Jackson, you know, that was another knock the fuck out for this week. You know, um, had him, you know, even though um, Jackson got up, you know, um, he, it was, it was a nasty knockout. It was similar to um, the Arthur Abraham knockout um, against, um, I believe the dude's name was Gavor or something like that. When he knocked him out when he was standing up, you know, it was sim similar to that knockout, but. You know, um, Jackson got up, Bonsu got up, and, you know, um, but the fight, you know, definitely could not continue. Um, it was two knockdowns in the fight in that one round. It was two knockdowns, um, but but um, Randall Bailey really, you know, really impressed me with this fight, but at the same, you know, because Bonsu is a pretty, pretty good contender at the welterweight division. Been there for, pretty, been there for a majority of his career, fought some some um decent competition at welterweight so so you know um it's a I, I thought it was a good overall fight um you know for um bailey you know and a lot of people know me know i'm a big randall bailey fan so so um now i, I believe he'll be fighting for the ibf um welterweight championship soon and the welterweight championship for the ibf has been having you know multiple champions for a while um, I, was, I can't even pronounce the guy who's the champion's name right now, but he knocked out um, um, dude, the, another dude whose name I couldn't pronounce, Isaac, and his last name started with an H. And um, the champion before that was Joshua Claudi, and the champion before that was Margarito, and then and before that was Kermit Centron. So you know, this IBF has had a revolving door of champions, and I think that. You know, um, maybe um, Randall Bailey does have a shot at winning the IBF welterweight championship after that fight. You know, um, I believe he might he might have to go out to Europe to um, do this fight. Who knows? But you know, overall, you know, good showing from Randall Bailey. Um, I hope to see more from him in the future. Um, Sugar Jackson. Um, hopefully, we see more from Jackson in the future. Um, I, I see that he attracts a pretty good following out in Belgium where he's from um so I do hope to see him in the ring again um after this um you know experience of being you know, knocked out in one round because no fighter is going to come back from being knocked out in one round the same you know either you could you could take this um you could take this two ways you can go back to the gym and go back to the drawing board and and say, hey, I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna be a better boxer. And I'm not gonna let this bother me. Or two, you can become damaged by it and let this situation haunt you for the rest of your career. And that's dangerous in the, in the sport of boxing. 
So, um, you know, I really hope to see more from Sugar Jackson. Um, definitely hope to see more from Randall Bailey. He's been watching him, um, you know, practically um, ever since I started watching boxing. I was watching Randall Bailey when he was the fight welterweight champion. So, um, you know, hopefully, you know, he gets the IBF welterweight title um, title shot. You know, um, sometime, sometime this year, hopefully. Um, who knows? But anyway, that was the distance. Thanks for watching. Peace.